Assalamu alaikum everyone. Uh, my name is Kareem and I am a head coach at the FDLM program. And today I, I have the pleasure to interview Mr. Imran. So how are you doing today, bro? Alhamdulillah, doing very well, thank you. Um, we're in London here, so the weather's been a bit cold. <laughs> That's so, fine, bro. <laughs> we just have to deal with it. Yeah. So tell us a bit about yourself, bro. So I'm a, uh, an accountant. So mm -hmm. very long hours. Um, I mean, it's been quite brutal for the last couple of years, I think with COVID as well. So especially when, when you're working from home. So with those long hours, of course, your habits become a bit <laughs> very bad in terms of eating and things like that. So I think that's one of the reasons why I considered this program. But uh, yeah, generally, um, yeah, an accountant for the last couple of years and uh, working for those companies is, is it takes a lot it takes its toll if you know what i mean so so cool thank you so how first you came across like the fdlm program or our materials it was through linkedin actually i think uh maybe one of my uh contacts i think might have been in uh connected and then of course as you can see um they're they're liking they're putting comments and everything and i was just just reading i think it, it led to probably about three weeks probably two three weeks leading up to when i actually went ahead with it so and then of course i um reached out to um adam as well um and then yeah we just got through like that but it was originally from linkedin that was that was the way to get it did you think that this program is a scam originally yes i did think that that was my um initial but i just read into it more and then you just sometimes uh, a leap of faith, as they say, um, yeah. just read into it a little bit more. And uh, <clears throat> I think the website just has much information. And I just felt something. And there was a couple of more comments that came through. And I was, you know what, let me just try it. So um, and even when they had the initial call as well, we were going through it. Um, I reached my target in such a in that short space of time that you don't if i lost any more <laughs> yeah. would i'll be like my kids <laughs> so uh, i thought that uh, i think 12 weeks was enough because we worked out if it was like half a kg or less than that per week i'd be hit my target perfectly so um so yeah that was the initial definitely i thought it was a scam but i looked into it a bit more uh even despite the price and everything you know i just went like a leap of faith he said you know what this is gonna be a game changer life-changing experience so i need to do it um, but it's only when you do the whole 12 week, you realize. So tell us a bit, tell us a bit about your experience. If you can like describe it, how, where were you like before joining the program? How yeah. was the journey and what's li your life like now? The first couple of weeks is all about trying to find combinations. Okay. What's good for you. So when I was reaching out to, to yourself or the group and you're just trying to find out what people are doing and what combinations are good. And then eventually you just find out, you know what, this is working. The breakfast, I have two different, three different variations. Lunch, I can play with two or three. Dinner, of course, at home, it could be anything we, whatever's cooked and everything. So, and like I said, you go on a holiday, you eat so much because it, everything's halal. And you come back and start, you already have that mindset. You know you can switch on. And when I came back, I lost like one, I think one or two kg, one point something, something kg straight after and I balanced it out again. Because I got back into my routine. I think the last week, I think because you know it's about to finish and you've hit your target, you just be a bit more chilled relaxed. Mm. It's a bit, yeah, chilled and everything. But even then, I was like only 0.2 last two weeks. 0 0.2, then 0 0.2. So 0 0.4 in the last two weeks. So I was trying to work out, okay, knowing the fact it's ending, what do I now do? Do I do down or just maintain? So mm -hmm. now I'm probably like I can maintain it. So the last week show that i can maintain it and i know where to um where i was going wrong for example last week so mm -hmm. I've, this week already i've already implemented certain things and um i, I already start to feel that you know there's making a benefit already this week as well so but so definitely you, from the beginning yeah go on. yeah so you, you're feeling like free now yeah your mindset is totally different uh although yeah. uh, the, the program doesn't say that no you can't have that and everything mm -hmm. but i think it's just a mindset but if you know that on the weekend i can just have that then that's good you build yeah. up to the week and have that nice meal or something like that you know like a doner kebab or a you know pizza or something like that or maybe you know a fudge cake or something like that again you know not a problem we can do it yeah so, so um, 
what I, I wanted to say is like now you have like the control over your decisions. So you are like your own boss when it comes to nutrition and training. Mm -hmm. So you're mm -hmm. not sticking to a like specific meal plan. No, there's no specific plan. You can just, like I said, our dinner, my mum usually or my wife makes the dinner and things. So it, I, I usually ask him, what are you guys making today? And I can just plan my day accordingly. Because um, I don't want to compromise, especially with, um, in our culture, our roti, and, our roti and rice are part of our staple diet anyway. Um, my mum would start getting worried if I was not eating rice. <laughs> she would get really worried about that. So, so I co incorporated making sure yeah. that is still my base and everything I play around with. Awesome. So in 12 weeks, how many kilos you've lost? I think it was at 91, 92 when I started now. And the least I got down, right now I think it was like 80 something. So maybe 12, 11, 12 kg. Yeah, roughly, yeah. Yeah, which is so, pretty good. Actually. Yeah. So you haven't like uh going to any gym or anything like that so you've, you've lost all this like hanging around in your home yeah. and controlling your food controlling food no ex i mean i did in the beginning i was still doing um swimming and uh like twice a week and uh, for the first couple of weeks and i had this foot injury so since about november i haven't done no running or swimming okay, and i've motivated my wife regarding this as well so Awesome, bro. That's fine. Um, so what would you say for people who are watching? Maybe they're on the fence right now. Mm -hmm. and they want to lose weight, but they're like, they're a bit skeptical. What would you say to them? No, definitely, I, I think if you want to change your life in, in a positive way, I, you know, not just losing weight, but just a mindset and you've got health issues, you want to really do it, then this is the program to do it. But it's all about yourself as well. You're just providing those little tools. But in the end, we have to do it. There's only so much you can do. Everything is from us. So in the beginning, yeah, it's going to be a bit of, it's going to be a rough patch, rough ride. But you just have to plug away. Get those little three, four things sorted in your life, like the sleeping, the water and everything. And then build on that. Find out what's good for you, what combinations you can do for your breakfast, your lunch. So you don't get bored of it. Although saying that, <laughs> I've got two or three things I have for my breakfast or two or three things for my lunch. I can eat those the whole week. I've got no problem with that because I, I just enjoy it. Yeah. Um, but for that, yeah, for that person who wants to do it, you, it's a leap of faith, really. You've got to do it. It's just if you really want to be at 5 kg, 15, 20, 30 kg, whatever, it's a long journey for those people, definitely. But in 12 weeks, I proved that you can do it. Um, despite the fact you have different, you know, your lifestyle is, you know, I mean, I've got a family, three kids and everything. So you're so busy. Plus work is quite high pressured. It's just balancing. Another fact, you might go on a weekend with some friends or something to see, um, to have something to eat. During the week, you just compensate for that. Knowing the fact that six days I can do what I can do and one day I spend with my friends and they won't even know the difference. You can do it because I think not just myself, but a lot of people within the groups have proven that they can do it. And the results are amazing. Um, never in my life I would have thought I would be number one get below 90 then below 80 that's unbelievable never thought that so oh, yeah. yeah it's a leap of faith they can do it so any brothers out there who are thinking about they should just do it it's a game changer honestly the only drawback of course is you're going to start buying new clothes <laughs> <laughs> your bills are going to go up <laughs> so I really uh, enjoyed this uh, interview with you bro uh, thank you for uh, sharing this with us and helping the others because a lot of people uh, at some point in the future will see or will watch this video and this inshallah hopefully will help them decide and like you said uh, make the leap of faith to improve their health right. and make yeah, the, the year of uh, 2023 their best year inshallah Inshallah. Okay. Thank you, bro, for joining me today. I wish you good luck. Salam alaikum. Bye, Sam.